Lack of sleep doesn't just leave us cranky and foggy, it can affect our bodies as a whole. Long-term sleep deprivation can lead to serious consequences, such as high blood pressure, diabetes, and weight gain. But what does it do to our skin? The answer is a lot. Let's start by going over what happens while you sleep. It may seem a little far-fetched, but researchers have found that the term, beauty sleep, is actually a real thing. While we sleep, the body recuperates and regenerates cells. It's also a time when healthy cells rise to the surface of the skin, and heal the damage done throughout the day. When the skin can't heal at night, it starts to weaken, which leaves it susceptible to irritants. Furthermore, it can decrease the amount of moisture in the skin, leading to dehydration, inflammation and sensitivity. All of this accentuates fine lines and wrinkles. It's all too easy to spot when someone hasn't slept enough by the bags under their eyes. Even though they are often temporary, and can be relieved by getting more sleep, prolonged periods of sleep deprivation can lead to those bags being more permanent. So in actuality, the term, beauty sleep, really does hold some meaning, since not getting enough can affect your beauty by accelerating the aging process. The next way that sleep can impact your beauty negatively, is by increasing stress. As you probably have experienced, when you don't get enough sleep you feel more stressed. This stress increases cortisol levels in the body, wreaking havoc on your immune system, blood sugar levels, and you guessed it, skin. Elevated levels of cortisol compromise the collagen fibers in the skin. This can result in premature aging including fine lines, wrinkles, and loss of elasticity. Skin will start looking dull and sallow, as cortisol constricts blood vessels reducing the amount of oxygen and nutrients reaching the skin. So now that you know about the negative impacts of lack of sleep. How do you solve the resulting skin problems from it? The skin can recover quickly after sleep deprivation simply by getting more sleep. This doesn't mean you should start sleeping 10 plus hours a night in hopes it will solve all of your skin problems. Actually, getting too much sleep is also an issue. Aim for quality sleep of about 7 to 8 hours each night, and you'll soon look and feel much better. What do we mean by quality sleep? Well, simply put, it means uninterrupted sleep in a comfortable environment. There are several things that can interrupt your sleep during the night which you can avoid with some basic preparations. The first, is needing to get up in the middle of the night to go to the bathroom. Avoid this, by not drinking fluids at least 3 hours before going to bed. Next, is to ensure your bedroom is the right temperature for sleep. Being too hot, or too cold when trying to sleep is a surefire way to ensure you don't get restful sleep. Make sure you've got appropriate blankets on your bed for the current season. Don't use a heavy down comforter in the summer, or just a thin sheet in the winter. Adjust a fan or heater to make sure you are at the optimal temperature. Finally, stop using the snooze button. Studies have shown that it is much better to just sleep right up until you need to get up, rather than hitting the snooze button 10 or 15 times before you really need to get up. Each time that alarm goes off, it's disturbing your sleep, and preventing any micro naps you're getting in between alarms from being actually restful. We hope that you've enjoyed watching this video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe so you can be kept up to date whenever we post a new video.